Hey guys, and today's from the install bay, we're gonna talk about updates. So Pioneer just came out with an update for the 42, 52, 62, 72, and 82 NEX radios. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk you through uh, what we like to call the heartache of getting a update onto a flash drive and then updating a unit. So let's get to it, shall we? All right, so the first thing you're gonna wanna do is launch your Internet Explorer. Then go to Pioneer Electronics. Dot com and come over here to the search bar and type in the model of your radio which this would be an AVH-4200 and EX hit return Scroll down to firmware and software. Get your firmware update. Click agree. Click download. Click save. Now hopefully you have a faster the computer than mine. Sit back and wait for it to download. Okay, so we have the folder downloaded onto the desktop. Now we want to take a thumb drive and put it into the USB in the computer and reformat the thumb drive. Go ahead and plug it in. Right click, format, make it a FAT32, right here, go ahead and start, okay, so once it's complete, go ahead, close this, go ahead and double click on that as a folder drag it to the bottom of your page. Now go ahead and double click on the zip file. Double click again. Once you get to here, go ahead, right click, copy, go to your thumb drive and select paste. Sit back, relax, and let it do its thing. It's gonna go ahead and move the files over. This usually takes about 20 minutes depending on the, how fast your computer is. Okay, we're done. So let's go ahead and we can, we can go ahead and close this. And go back and we'll eject this. All right, so the hard part's over. Let's get to the radio. All right, so what we want to do is plug the thumb drive into USB 1. Then go ahead and come over to your home page, hit AV, hit source off, go to your gears, scroll all the way to the bottom, go to system information, firmware update, select continue. All right, after an extended period of time, uh, this screen will come up. It's telling you the old version to the new version. Go ahead and click start. There again, sit back, relax, get yourself a, a drink. So once it's done, it's gonna give you this information, press home screen to reset product. Go ahead and hit the Windows button. Unit's gonna shut down and restart. 
All right, guys, this brings this one to an end. Uh, we hope you found this one very helpful. Go ahead and update your radios, get them to their most latest firmware. It fixes tons of issues usually. Um, subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Thanks for watching as usual. You can find us on Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram. You guys have a great night. We'll see you later next time. Bye. It's like a ventriloquist. <laughs> see ya. <laughs> You okay there, Pink Panther? You look like Pink Panther. I don't look like Pink Panther. <laughs> yeah. I can, well, I fix all that post. All right, guys. What? Just kidding. What the fuck is this? <laughs> all right, guys. Are you, are you done? <laughs>